going to church, family brunches, and spending time with loved ones. That's how many Southeast Texans spend their Sundays. One foster teenager spent the day learning about others who are just like him. Six News anchor Ashley Gaston met one teen who wants to share his story in hopes of finding a forever family. It's a place where Southeast Texans go to eat wings, watch basketball, and share stories. I've uh, experienced a lot. Today, Sean is meeting other teenagers just like him at Buffalo Wild Wings in Beaumont. Like I've been traveling home to home. He spent his life in the foster care system. He's 16 years old. I would like for someone to adopt me. Mm -hmm. Why is that? Because I want to have somebody that could actually love me and care about me. Mm -hmm. I was stuck in one when I was a baby. So. We wanted to learn more about what Sean likes and dislikes, so we walked outside the restaurant. Sean says the fresh air, peace and quiet is more like his element. You said you like to live in the country. Why? Because of the nature. Mm -hmm. Will you go into a little more explanation for me? The horses get to uh, round up horses and go to uh, go fishing and go dirt bike riding if I could and four wheeler riding. And you have to do something real good to be on the news or something. But then right now he lives in a foster home in the country in Nacogdoches, Louisiana. He said he'd like to move again if it meant a permanent home. I would love them and care about them too and love to go to church every day and actually spend time with people all the time. Sean says when he grows up, he wants to be a missionary. I have my own testimony and I, uh, I like to help people. And a testimony he shared with other foster teenagers at the table. Sean said it's important to be proud of who you are and where you come from in order to make strides for the future. In Beaumont, Ashley Gaston, KFDM 6 News. Sean says he makes A's and B's in school but struggles with math. He believes adoptive parents could help him with his math skills. If you're interested in meeting Sean, call 951-3354 or log on to adoptchildren.org where you can also find other children in the area who are looking for a forever family.